Alright, so today what I'm going to be doing is giving a much more detailed um, description of how to make glow for geometry dash icons, which I found a much easier way to do it than I showed in my last video where I just showed that you know lose the outline of the object and it can be a bit inaccurate. This is a way that you can get the object to have perfect glow every single time. So I'm going to show you on a, say like a really complicated thing to have glow on. You know what, let's just make a new file, okay? And all I'm going to do is, I'm going to just very loosely draw a box, okay? I can give this box perfect glow. I'm going to do, I'm just going to show you uh, this with a background as well, so it's a lot easier. So all you need to do is you need to install Boltbait, which is a paint.net plugin. It's really easy to install. I'll probably leave a link for it in the description. So you just look in the description and find it, then you'll be able to get Boltbait. You don't even need to select anything. All you need to do is just be on the correct layer with the icon. You need to hit Effects, go to Object, and then go to Outline Object. Okay. You're gonna have a um, white selected, obviously glow and you can change the size of the outline of the object. Now I'm pretty sure glow is about five pixels big. So I just hit OK here and you can see I've now got perfect glow for this. Um, and I'll do another one just to show you. So say for let's, let's do this. Let's do this ship. Um, select it perfectly. There we go. And you always want to make it just a bit bigger, so 200 by 130. And you want to delete all this, obviously. Paste the ship, place it in the middle. Don't actually have it selected. Don't have the, um, object. Oh, that's not what I'm meant to do. That's quite cool, though. I'll uh, play with these in a bit. But um, what you want to do is want to go to object outline object and we've got perfect glow every single time absolutely perfect glow um, so all you need to do once you've got this is then just place it in your glow sheet so if I just go down to my game sheet that's the peerless one I'm doing uh, the glow sheet here um, obviously the glow sheet is quite small and there's not enough space to Put another icon on it. So what you can actually do is if you go into the game, uh, go into the glow sheet game sheet. Hey, peerless, what the hell I'm saying? The glow sheet peerless. Scroll all the way down to the bottom, and you'll find something here that says size string, and it'll give the size of the whole thing. So you can see if I just select the whole thing, it says 4096 by 2237, and this says 4096 by 2237. What you can do is you change it to say. 5096, hit save, and all you need to do is copy this, hit new, change that to a 5, hit OK, delete this, paste, take the whole thing, copy it, delete, oh crap, not save, delete this one. Go back on your actual glow sheet, expand canvas, and now you've got more size to work with. Um, so obviously this ship already has a glow, like a glow placement or whatever, but you can just paste this in here and edit in the game sheet, um, the glow sheet, peeler, sorry, the position of it, so say I just go to ship, whatever it is. And then change the location of it, whatever. I covered that in a previous video already. So we're just going to discard that, discard that. Um, and I don't even want any of this anyway. Just going to delete all this. Um, and yeah, that's basically all you have to do to get perfect glow every single time. So I'll leave a link to Bolt Bot, Bolt Bait in the description. And it's really easy to set up. You won't even need my help with that. It'll just be a really simple, you know, like three-step little thing. Um, that'll tell you how to do it and yeah that's what you need to do thanks for watching